Timothy Verrill is charged with two counts of first-degree murder. Prosecutors say the victims, 48-year-old Christine Sullivan and 32-year-old Jenna Pellegrini, were stabbed to death in a house in Farmington in January of 2017. Today, lawyers presented their final arguments about whether some evidence should be allowed at trial. One issue is whether the jury should hear about Verrill allegedly asking his brother to take him to see a priest after the murders. It shows an abrupt change of demeanor and behavior on the defendant's part, entirely consistent with committing uh, a life-changing offense. But defense lawyers say there are a lot of possible explanations for that request, and to let the jury hear the state's theory of why Vera wanted that meeting is prejudicial. The brother's statement was that Mr. Vera said only that he wanted to see a priest. The only reference to confession was the brother indicated that his interpretation of Vera's desire to see a priest was that Vera wanted to confess, or that was a possible reason. Both sides also argued evidence that Vera was allegedly involved with the drug business and whether he regularly carried a knife. Defense lawyers say that evidence is simply speculation. There's no evidence that this knife equals to or is even consistent with the murder weapon. The judge issued no rulings today. The trial is expected to start in October and last about a month. Reporting live, I'm Andy Hershberger, WMUR News 9.